Well, it's uh, chemo weave. I made that up. See what I did right there? Blinky neck. I slept this morning. I haven't been sleeping but this morning. Wow. <laughs> but I tried Somonex last night. I was naughty. I feel a bit sick because I had pizza in bed. And I had two Yorkies in bed. <laughs> what else did I have? A little can of cork in bed. Not a feel bleh. <laughs> no fault. I keep thinking, well, when I'm on chemo, I won't want to do it. So, a bit close enough. Because on my phone, I can't move you. <sighs> oh, yeah, it's chemo eve day. I'm feeling a bit... I don't know. It's been coming, on it? So, I've got used to the idea. I've had no choice. So, I should be used to the idea. I'm not, though. I feel a bit pissed off about it, really. I don't want to have it. I've had a rough few years, as most people will know. And I don't want to do chemo. I don't want to poison myself. Poison my whole body. Other day I was thinking, oh, just makes you feel lethargic. I'll just be tired. I'll just be chilled out. I'll set in with my diamond dart. Like, really chilled. It's not going to be like that, though, is it? I don't think. Poison. I don't want poison. I just want to be normal. But in order to get normal, I have to do it. I still don't know my outcome. I still don't know where it is. That's a bit I don't get as well because... Because I've had me... Um, what do you call it? Tumour out. I know it's in the lymph nodes, but... They can't really tell. They only knew it were in my lymph nodes because they took some lymph nodes out when they took my cancer out, my tumour, and they tested them. So, oh, you're so cute. That's why animals are good when you're having a bad time. Because it's just coming up and it just wants to love me. It's trying to headbutt me and get me. Hello, Stormzy. <laughs> can you hear it purring? I don't know if you can hear it or not. Licking mm. me. I don't suppose that'd be a good idea after tomorrow. <laughs> but yeah, I'm there at one o'clock tomorrow. What was I saying? I don't know what I was saying. But yeah, I don't I don't fancy it. I don't fancy it at all. I think uh one of the big things of it is that it's going to be for a long time it's going to feel relentless I might be alright off it might not be that bad I'm one of these all that I expect the worst and then if it's not the worst it's not so bad I in effect poison myself anyway with my diet to be quite honest especially with all the sugar I'm terrible absolutely terrible for sugar uh, just before I got diagnosed with cancer, I cut it all out, completely cut sugar out. I mean, completely. I wouldn't even have my hair vitamin sweets because they had sugar in them. I thought, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it properly. So I completely cut sugar out. And then I, I, I weren't so good. But they say you're not so good while it all gets out of you. But I weren't so good for months. It, I just I never got right. I had amazing headaches amazing every day relentless woke up with them like a hangover every day like really banging really raging That's, I don't know you tell me to eat healthy and be good and then that's what I were doing I were having Rivita with boiled eggs on and I were having spinach and I were having smoothies with spinach in and green stuff kale all the rest of it and I knew I weren't going to be so good for a bit, but I just never got better. And then I got diagnosed with, can with this breast thing, and then boom, I thought, stop it. I started eating all crap again, like, but more so comfort eating. 
so that's what it's been like. <laughs> so that's where I'm at. That's what I'm doing. Eating crap. Eating pizza at bloody half 11, half 11 or whatever it was. At night. Full, full fat cork. Two Yorkies. Two. And. Let's see where they are. I can't find any of the wrappers. I've got wrappers all over the place. No, I can't find them. Brownie things. Little brownies. I had about three of them. That's terrible, isn't it? That's absolutely terrible. But I can't do that from tomorrow. What the hell have you had on for more than five minutes? What's that? It's a truck outside, softie. You're so beautiful. Right, we'll start yapping. I uh, didn't want to get my camera out doing a proper YouTube video, so I thought I'd just spend a few minutes on here. With my cosy jumper on. You want in on the action, don't you? I know you do. Right, anyway, catch you later. Bye.